Hey dolls, welcome to the dollhouse. Today I'm just going to be showing you guys how I wash my curly hair extensions. Basically, I've had my hair up in a pineapple for a week with a headband and my hair really needs to be washed. So I'm going to take the whole blends um, collection by Garnier. This is the smoothing shampoo and conditioner. I'm going to take that pink brush and this leave-in conditioner and these are all the products that I'm going to be using today. I'm going to split my hair into two sections and put one into a ponytail holder. Then I'm going to begin by rinsing my hair with just plain water and I'm just saturating all of my hair and I'm doing it in like a downward motion so that way I don't get my braids wet because when I wash my hair I do not wash my braids I just wash the hair extensions because I find that when you get your braids wet they start to smell so I try my best not to get my braids wet so all I did there was just take the shampoo and put a dime size not a dime size about a half dollar size amount into my hand and I just smooth it down to the hair in a downward motion I'm not rubbing the hair together I'm not scrunching the hair up or anything like that I just keep the hair in a downward motion and then I take that brush and go ahead and start to detangle the hair I never detangle my hair with a brush when it's dry because I do not want it to have any breakage so I always just detangle when I've already got water and product in my hair and I just went and took a little bit more shampoo after I detangled and I just ran that in a downward motion through the hair once again and then I'm just going to take that hair that I put the shampoo in and I'm going to leave that to the side and then I'm going to begin saturating the other side of my hair with water and then I'm basically just going to repeat the step. I'm going to take the shampoo and I'm going to smooth that onto the hair in a downward motion and then I'm going to begin to detangle it with the brush. Now this brush is my favorite brush in the whole world. I got it from Sally's Beauty Supply Store and it doesn't have any holes or any anything on the brush that can possibly pull your hair out or snag it or damage it in any way and that's why I love this brush so much. So I have a link below so you guys can check it out. Now what I'm doing is just rinsing out the shampoo from that first side and I'm just gonna make sure I rinse that out really well and then I'm gonna go ahead and apply conditioner, detangle it and then I'm gonna let it sit and then I'm gonna do the exact same thing to the other side just like we did with the shampoo. So now I'm just going to go ahead and rinse out all of that conditioner and then I'm going to scrunch my hair up and wring out as much water as I can with my hands because I'm not going to be using a towel or anything on my hair and this is just to prevent any frizz or tangles. I'm then going to take that leave-in conditioner from Garnier that I showed at the beginning of the video and I'm just going to smooth this into the hair still going in a downward motion I'm still not scrunching up the hair or rubbing it together or anything like that so after I apply my leave-in conditioner I basically just leave my hair hanging down over my shoulders in those same two sections until it dries so basically I don't use a blow dryer or a diffuser or anything I just let it completely air dry and this is how it turns out so I hope this video helps some of you guys out if it did go ahead and leave me a thumbs up make sure you comment subscribe and thanks for watching